Hello everyone, welcome back to our Telvin CSS tutorial series. In today's video, we will be creating a simple interactive star rating system using Telvin CSS, HTML and JavaScript. Let's get started. In a rating system, users click on a star to rate a product or service. The selected star and all preceding stars will light up while the remaining stars will stay grey. Today, we are going to create a 5 star rating system. Now, we will start with our HTML structure. First, let's create the HTML structure for our rating component. So, to save our time, I have created a basic HTML structure as you can see here. This is the basic HTML structure. We are going to have 5 SVG stars inside a table. That is this one. These are the 5 SVG stars. Star will be represented as an SVG path inside an SVG tag. So as you can see, this is the SVG tag. And that SVG tag contains an SVG path. This is the SVG path which is inside the SVG tag. We also give each star a class of star. That is, these are the five stars and each star is given class named star. for later referencing in JavaScript. Next, let's add some size using Kelvin C. We are going to the size grey by default in the text grey 400 class. We will also set the width and height of the stars to 6 using the W6 and H6 classes. So W6 and H6 are basically imported from this Telvin CSS CDN link which I have included in the head section of the HTML file. So, including of this link in the HTML file is very very important and one should not forget to do that because importing this link in the HTML file helps us to use the Telvin classes and make a new file. Now comes the fun part. We are going to use JavaScript to make the stars interactive. We are going to add a click event listener to each star. A little code of JavaScript I have added to make the rating response. That star and all three stars will turn yellow while the remaining stars will stay grey. I will show you the output in the coming part of the video. For now, stay tuned. Let's work through the JavaScript code together. 
we first select all the stars using document dot query selector all we then loop through each star and add a click event listener to it as you can see i have added here with click event listener in a loop inside the click event handle we loop through the stars again again i have added here new if the current star index is less than equal to click star index we turn the star yellow as you can see this is the logic i have used otherwise we turn the star gray now data rating system is ready and test it up as you can see here is the output screen so by default i have set the color of the stars to gray adjust accordingly you can see now three stars are yellow and two are gray so if you want to give a five star rating then all the five stars will be yellow if you want to give one star and if you click on the first star all the rest becomes gray so this is exactly what we wanted so if you want to give a two star rating then you have to click on two stars if you want to give a five star four star rating you need to click on the four stars again if you change your mind and you want to give one star rating then the other three stars will turn to gray you can see so this is the main logic uh, behind the working of the rating of the stars so the appearance of the stars is done by telvin css part and the working of the rating system that is the color change from gray to yellow yellow to gray is done by the javascript part this simple rating system can be used in daily can rating a product in a Rating the post in social media app. The main step to put your name. So, if you want to change the color of the default color of the star. it will you can customize it here and change it accordingly if you want it red you can turn it to red but if you change it here 
the same you need to change it here but for this rating system one common color is used for all the five stars so we cannot use different colors for all the stars So if you want to change uh, grey color here, you need to change it overall. So if I change it here, if I keep it as red, I need to change it accordingly. Tell me in CSS part. So we'll just now check. Yes, the code is working. So you can change it as per your requirement. video.